Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for visiting once again. And for those of you who may be new to this channel, I am Demia. I'm on a weight loss journey. I turned 50 in January and there's a certain amount of pounds that I would like to lose before my 50th birthday. So um, as of today, um, well, let me jump into this week's video. Um, I did my weigh-in yesterday, today is Saturday, and I lost 4.2 pounds this past week. Now, if you've been following me in order, I just uploaded last week's video earlier today, and that's because I was having a problem with YouTube. They changed some kind of setting, and I couldn't figure it out, and I just didn't feel like being bothered, so I put it down for a couple days, and I finally figured it out today. So that just got uploaded. So this video right here is back to, so these two videos are back to back. So I lost 4.2 pounds this week. So that brings my grand total to 12.4. Something like that, 12 point something. So I'm feeling good about myself. Um, I didn't do any exercise this week. This was my first full week back to work. So this is actually week three, but we actually went back to our regular schedule, full set of kids. Um, so I've been tired all week. The only day I walked was Monday. I walked Monday morning. I put the video up after, you know, I do this little chat. Um, but that's the only exercise I did. I was supposed to start and arm challenge, a 30 day arms challenge this week on September 1st. I didn't do it. When I tell y'all I have been exhausted, I was exhausted every day but Friday. So I only had enough strength to go home, eat dinner, take a shower, talk to my child, talk to my boo. I may have talked to my mother and then I was knocked out. So I was exhausted all week. But, um, and my meals this week were all the same. So I woke up, when I got to work, I had a smoothie. So that's like by 7.30, 8 o'clock. Then around 10 o'clock, I was having oatmeal. My lunch was a salad every day this week. And then at night, um, well then my afternoon snack was Yeah, I don't know. I know yesterday I had applesauce. The day before, I think I had some cashews. I can't really think what I had for my afternoon snacks. And then my dinners varied all week. Two nights I had um, some flatbread pizzas. A flatbread, a flatbread pizza. One night it was a shrimp pesto. The other night, it was a garlic shrimp. If my mother's watching, she's gonna complain about the cholesterol level in shrimp. Don't tell her. Um, and then, um, I don't remember what I had the other night. I really don't remember. Um, so, I don't really have a lot to share by way of any, um, activity I may have done because I didn't do any. So I'm hoping that next week or at some point, so I don't think I'm going to do a challenge this month um, because the way my mind works, we are already in day whatever today is. I think today is the 6th. No. Today I think is the 4th because it's Saturday. So I feel like I'm already behind four days and I know it's a 30 day challenge and I can just start it any day, but the way my crazy mind works, I will want to start on the first day of the month. So I am going to, however, try to incorporate some more exercise. I'm not making no promises because again, a girl be tired after work. My commute home is long, unfortunately, this year because of what time I get off work now. Um, but that's neither here nor there. And a sister got to go to bed early because a sister got to get up early because again, my commute to work is a little off this year. 
So, um, so I'm proud of myself that I ate well this past week and um, I was able to get the weight off, keep the weight off. So, you know, I was saying last week that I hope that the next video was going to be a report on a weight loss because I gained a couple pounds last week. So, um, I must say though that I'm very pleased with the people that I come into contact with on a daily basis. So my coworkers, um, some family members, um, and just seeing people on social media that are just working out and eating right and, you know, it's just a pleasure to see that, I guess we all like, y'all, we about to reach 50. Or somewhere around the same age, we need to keep it together. But it's good to know that this is the type of conversations that I'm having with people or that we're all kind of at the same place in our lives that where we want to do better and be better. Um, so um, it's, it's a good feeling to know that I'm not going through this by myself. So one of my coworkers, um, so a couple of my coworkers, we've talked about, you know, what things are we gonna do on our lunch breaks? Now that we're back up and running and we get to take our breaks now, what are we gonna do? So there's been suggested of, of course, walking the track and then um, doing some jump roping, which I gotta remember to put my jump rope in my bag. Um, you know, we're checking in with each other about the water intake that we have going on. So it's just really a pleasure to know that there are other people going through the same thing. Not everyone is necessarily on a weight loss journey like I am, but everybody, you know, there's quite a few people around me who are interested in staying active. I just say staying active. Staying active and, you know, trying to do the right thing. So it's very, very refreshing and it keeps me motivated to continue on this journey that I am on. Um, so I went out today with my mother, ran a couple errands, and then we went to lunch. And as much as everything on that menu looked delicious, I just ordered a cop salad. Yes, I did. And then tonight for dinner, I had, I put on my plate two turkey sausages that my boo cooked on the grill earlier today and some mixed vegetables. turkey sausages and half of the plate half of the vegetables that I put on my plate so I don't know if that's because I have ate lunch like around 1 30 ish or if my eyes were just bigger than my stomach and that's all I needed to eat so and like I said in my previous video that I'm trying to work on portion control not that that played a factor today. I just wasn't hungry and didn't want to eat the full plate. So I don't know, but it's good. It's good to um, hear or good to see or it feels good. My cousin's in town. My accountability partner that's from, that lives in Texas, she's in town. So we went out, we met up for dinner last night with my brother and a couple other people. And um, when she saw me, she said, look at you losing the weight. I see it, I see it. So again, I don't see it physically. I don't feel it physically. Um, like I had them going down a pant size or anything like that. So, but if other people are seeing it, it's uh, good to know. Y'all like my shirt? My shirt says, Godly, Godly love. Isn't that pretty? I like the colors. I digress. Um, so that's always good to see when I hear people saying, you know, that they see that the weight is coming off. So I'm just gonna keep doing what I'm doing. Just gotta keep doing what I'm doing. So I'm proud of me. I'm proud of me. Um, and as much as I feel like, you know, I've been at this since March and I feel like I should have more weight off, but I just had to figure some things out and get it together. 
and I feel like I'm getting it together. Every day is a struggle, every day is a journey. Oh, I came in here today and had some potato chips. Mm -hmm. The boo had a big old bag of cheddar and sour cream potato chips or something on the table. And because they were wide open, just sitting there, I had some, so blame him, not me. He had the nerve to come in and uh, give me a kiss and be like, smelling. What you been eating? Dumb potato chips you left on the table. So his fault. So what I went for a second handful, but then I put them away. So I did have some um, chips today. But I, um, yeah, we won't do that again. So, but I'm human and these things happen and I'm doing the best that I can every day. Every day is a struggle. Um, but the important part is that I am Keeping the one, keep, keep, keeping the one. There used to be a song about that. Keeping the A different world, I think, had a clip. Anyway, stay focused. Um, so that's my story. So here's my one video from Monday when I did walk the track. Thanks for watching. If you are brand new to this site or to my channel, please make sure you like, share, comment and subscribe please make sure you hit the red not red make sure you hit the bell so and hit all so that you can be notified every time i upload a video and i hope you will go back and see all my previous videos and then come back next week to catch up on more bye good morning and happy monday Back out here, early morning walking. This will not become a pattern. It's just something I'm able to do for the next couple of days. So I'm actually at work. Just walked for about 45 minutes around this track. And um, I didn't keep count, so I don't even know how many laps I did to know how far I may have walked. But it's all good. It was just the purpose of getting out here and it feels good. I miss early morning walking to get out here and clear your mind and prepare for the day. But I'm still at it, still working on me, still trying to get in shape and live a better lifestyle. Monday morning, top of the week. I hope everyone is doing their fitness, doing what they need to do to reach their fitness goals because I'm slowly but surely doing mine. Have a blessed one.